Hello everyone and welcome to Summer Number Plays. The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Not a daily run, just a regular Isaac run. Because I, let's face, I'm not good at dailies. I'm not, uh, they're not, they don't, I don't do well on them. They oftentimes will be not good for me. And so I figure... Why not just go back to the Binding of Isaac that I really enjoyed, you know? Where there's there's not a lot of pressure. I can take as long as I want, and even though there is a score still up, it doesn't actually mean a goddamn thing. So that's kind of fun. You know, I, I've never been fast. I've never been good at maximizing things, so... I feel like... If, if we, you know, you gotta have at least one of those, two of those, if you want to be any sort of contender. And I don't, so I cannot. Therefore, I will not continue to try. So we'll just do regular runs. And that sounds like it'll make me enjoy the game a lot more, because I obviously have not been playing it very much. Uh, there, I can, I can tell you there will be more videos of this game when the Afterbirth expansion hits PS4. Because PS4 is where all my stats are and like all my unlocks. So, it'll be nice to piggyback off that and just get it in the po the place where it matters. We got Dice Shard and D6, which is... That's nice. Okay, so like this, for one, is going to get re-rolled by the D6 into something that I will not deal with right now. And we're going to save Dice Shard for a situation in which I don't have a D6, but I need a re-roll. As opposed to this situation where I could probably get another reroll. Since this is an XL floor. Seems the best way to... Oh, I like when they explode and there's a bunch of them nearby. Okay. One of those champions gave me flies, I just noticed. That's a dead end. Guess everything is up here. Which you know is... Also, keeping in mind that it's an XL floor... I need to not take red heart damage at all. Because if I do, there's no deal with the devil for me. And that's just unacceptable. Falling into the whole not getting a deal with the devil, right? Oh, I even, I started to loop the other way. Fuck it. Let's go in here then. Oh my god, I hate when these guys are here. Nope, 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 nope. Don't hit me. Alright, what do we got? The moon is good. I don't want my die shard to be locked in the curse room, though. But it looks like that's what happened. And then we'll blow this up. Since we're in need of less bombs since I used one in the curse room. Or in the secret room, more specifically. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay, something good in here, please. Yeah, yeah, Mulligan's good. Gonna give me that shit. Well, that's not what I was looking to do. I'm gonna come in here, get my die shard back. Didn't quite do it in time to not take more damage. But everything is gonna be okay. Oh, okay, bombs would have been nice in this area. But we can still get them. All's not lost. Not even a little bit is lost. In fact, nothing... You gotta be fucking kidding me that that hit me. That hit my ankle. Nobody's getting incapacitated from an ankle shot. Why am I in here, by the way? I have a reroll. I gotta use it. Thanks for the penny. If I get two more of those, maybe I can buy a bomb. Then maybe those burn... Or the bomb chests will... Be nice and give me some more bombs so I can keep the cycle going. Reroll that shit. Into some shit. So we're, now we're going to reroll that shit into this shit. Oh my god, more shit. Weird how game breaking bug is one of the worst items. Don't break shit except my spirits. Only breaks my spirits. A diam. Okay. Well, so much for. Me going like, oh, hey, give me an all stats up. Maybe we can get that on the next boss, though. Kind of wanted it for this one, just so the la next boss would be a bit easier. But Cuba meat is also acceptable. Getting Cuba meat will be the biggest damage dealer we have. 
It wouldn't be if we would spawn flies a bit more regularly. Ball of bandages. Okay. Ragman's alright. I like Ragman as a boss. He will kind of take a little while to defeat, though, probably. Oh my god, the spiders take so many hits. No, no, no. Oh, you did not hit me! I call bullshit. Bullshit on that shit. Okay, well, he's half dead. Luckily, his range is pretty bad. Okay, that spider, no. No, no, no. Like, I want to get in there with Bandage Girl, but I also want to not die. And right now, those two strategies are conflicting. That's right, you're dead. You son of a bitch. Die. Kill, kill. Kill it before it runs into me. How many bullets does it take? Too many bullets. Oh, pajamas is good, though. Okay, um... Do we have any way to get bombs? There's a small, small, small chance if there's a half-price bomb in here. There's not a half-price bomb in here. There is a full-price bomb in here. Oh, but... Oh, but... Nope, can't buy it. Was there any other way that we could get a coin? There wasn't. There was not. So, let's go. Oh my god, I have the smallest of zits, like, right almost inside my nose. That's the worst place for those, isn't it? Anyway. Oh, we can buy a bomb now! No thanks, not getting in there. Mob trap rooms, so rarely worth a damn thing. Even boss trap rooms. Actually, even less rarely. Or actually, even more rarely worth a damn thing. They're almost never just flat-out items in there. That's one thing I miss from the vanilla Isaac. They used to just give you free items for that shit. But they don't anymore. Uh, I'm not going to take the rosary after I just took pajamas. Because that would be redundant. Oh, don't give me this. Champion version of the most annoying cursor enemy there can be. Get hit by my bullets. Stop dodging. Oh my ass. Dude! About to piss me off. That's what was about to happen there. All right, we got two rerolls. That's not a good item, so I'm not gonna take that. Uh, let's reroll it. That's that. Eh, yeah, I'm gonna take that. I don't like using it on mushrooms, but if there's some way we could become invincible for a period of time. Then I could use it on mushrooms. But really, I just want to be blowing up rocks and pots. Thunder Thighs would have been a nice first room item. Especially in that last floor. Where a bomb could have done so many things. Damn. I thought they would all die. But they did not. One bullet is all it took. All it took, though. Oh, thanks for that nickel. Uh, I'm very, I'm, te I'm kind of tempted to do that, but no. I just watched on Netflix the latest Adam Sandler movie, The Ridiculous Six, and while it's not a good movie. It's not worth a shit ton of uproar. Like some people are like want to boycott Adam Sandler movies because like, oh, he's not funny anymore, so he it's, he needs to be stopped. People f actually fucking write articles like this person needs to be stopped because they make stuff that I don't like on a consistent basis. Like you're such a piece of shit for that. 
But how about you just not treat it like it's a big deal? Because it isn't. It's really not. At all. At all. Somebody makes a bad movie. I mean, first of all, you saw it for free. What the fuck are you complaining about? It's on Netflix, for God's sakes. Oh, it ruined your Netflix subscription. Somebody actually posted a tweet that freaking... And actually, Northern Lion retweeted it, and that's why I saw it. And I'm like, this is bullshit. Somebody po posted a tweet like, this is why you pay $8.99 for a Netflix subscription. And it's just like a scene from The Ridiculous Six where a donkey shits. And it's like... Okay, even if that's not, like, necessarily comedy gold, what makes you think that's the only reason I'm paying for Netflix? Oh, for all of a sudden, the only reason I'm paying for Netflix is so that I can watch Adam Sandler movies once every year and a half. Like, what? where the fuck do you live that you think that's the case? At no point is that actually a direct argument against Netflix for, like, making that a thing. I don't know. I hate critics. I get mad when critics, like, they jump. It, I'm not saying it's a bandwagon. I mean, it is definitely a bandwagon, but that doesn't mean every critic is on a bandwagon. But it just sounds... Like, these statements they make that are... They don't actually mean anything if you think about them. Like, you're paying eight ninety nine a month for Netflix so that they can make these kind of movies. Like, that's not at all. That's like, what, 1% of their catalog? And by 1%, I mean 0.001% of their catalog is that particular Adam Sandler movie. So how about you? Also, how about you just not get irrationally mad for no reason? Like, that's also a thing that I think maybe people could uh, service themselves to discontinue. <sighs> so it annoys me. Even people who are, like, on my side in terms of arguments. If you argue, if you even if you think the way that I do, but you argue your point wrong, I'm still gonna fucking hate you. And that's not to say that he was on my side. Like, I, I'm of the mind that if someone has the money, they can make whatever the fuck they want and release it to the public if the public... You don't... The public doesn't have to watch it. And it's not like they there was any false advertising. There was a trailer of the movie. It very accurately captured what is in the movie, given that it only took scenes that were in the movie. At what point was your, like, mental fortitude thwarted? Like, oh, they tricked me into watching this. They show it. There's, it's the movie. What were you, what did you expect? I don't understand why you could possibly cry foul over something like that. Second level bandage girl's fine. Uh, oh, something good in here, please. That's not it. That's also not it. I I don't even want to take that. I'd rather just like see what maybe an angel deal is gonna offer me later, if that's even possible. If it's not, that's also fine. But we're gonna leave and go to the next floor. We're really slow. I tend to not beat the clock unless I have a powerful run. And right now we don't. Uh, that was, th I'm sorry, this poop was considered a blessing. It made the blessing sound, the positive influence. I don't think so. Yes, I, I bet that there was a key in there. I gambled away my life savings, but you know, that's, how, that's how it works sometimes. High Priestess is all right. I want to go in here now. I didn't get hit by that spider. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, I ain't stopping until you pay out. I'm going to play this fast and loose. That was... I mean, actually, that's pretty good. I, I'm slow. Now I'm not slow. All right, we're out of... And yeah, there was a rainbow poop right there anyway, so... Okay. But we're out of Spirit Heart Protection. I'm so mad. 
I hit it and it was supposed to die, but it didn't. It didn't die. It didn't even alter its trajectory in the slightest. Like, it kind of felt like it did, but then it just, like, got right back on its rightful path. And so I didn't move, because I thought I had hit it out of the way of myself, but that's not the case at all. Game-breaking bug proving that it is a complete piece of shit. That's got to be a thankless job, I assume, because I would never thank you for it. I just assume everybody thinks like me, but they don't. If they did, there wouldn't be as many problems in this world. In fact, there would be zero problems, because we'd all agree. Like, even though problems would still exist, like, they wouldn't be problems. You know what I mean? Like, there would still be world hunger, but we would all agree that that's not that big a deal. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, yes, come on, kill them. Ah, uh, but they all move at the same pace. They can't really, like, you know. Like, they're trying to, like, chase fuck each other, but it's not working. Because they move at the same pace. It's a never-ending battle. Or it's a stalemate, I should say. Also, they're all jumping in exactly the right way they need to jump in order to cut off any avenue of escape that I'm trying to get here. I'm not, a, I'm not really appreciating that. Oh, uh, my God, gaps. Excuse you. Also, where did this bitch come from? You were not... Nobody died over here. At least as far as I could have told. Okay, die then. Die. Oh, my God. Tears up knock back, knock back shot. Gotta get it, I guess. Our tears got bigger for some reason. That's weird. Also, knockback shot. Proving that it doesn't actually knock back. Considering that those spiders did not move. And if you're not knocking back the smallest enemies in this game, then, you know, what are you advertising as part of your effect? Look at that. You're not going anywhere. I guess? I guess you're kind of getting pushed back? Maybe I need way more tears ups to really get that going. Sharp plug is almost worth buying, just not in our current situation. I'm gonna buy that shit, though. I'm gonna buy a heart so we don't die, and we're gonna leave. We're gonna go fight the boss. I'm gonna use the High Priestess card on it. And that kind of didn't work very well. Probably should have saved it. This boss very easily dealt by no... Fuck it. That had a bomb in it and I didn't see it. Pisses me off. This is just one of those bad runs. Not good items go happening right now. But also... Well, actually just... Okay, well this changes things. Thank you, Magic Mushroom. I do applaud your diligence in showing up right when we need you. Now let's steamroll the rest of this, even though that still probably won't be a thing that happens. But we're a lot better than we were. Can I charm people into killing themselves? Because if I could do that, I would quit YouTube. And that would be my new... You know, I'd be a contract suicider, is basically what I would be. And there would be a lot of money in that. I would have no moral objections to that whatsoever. I have no moral objections to anything whatsoever. It's a freeing state of mind that I was born with and can't really change. So, stop asking, I guess. Oh, give me that black heart. Yes. 
Yes, also the key. Oh my god, you're one of the annoying champions. Just die. Okay. Oh, you dropped a battery, though. That does make you, that makes you, in hindsight, better in terms of how I feel about you. Oh my god. Why won't they just make a PS4 port of Skyrim already? Is it because that would sort of counteract what they're doing with Elder Scrolls Online? Because if so, why don't you just throw that in the fucking trash? Nobody wanted that to begin with. We want PS4 Skyrim port. Let's, uh, go fight the boss. I almost had, like, a real thought to just use my D6 right now. Like, that's... I guess that's the kind of borderline crazy I'm at at the moment. I was just like, what if I press spacebar and then ruin my reroll? Like, how would people react to that? You know, I like to troll my Isaac audience sometimes. Talk about taking items. Like, I would never take that item. And then, like, as I'm saying that, just take it and then walk away like nothing happened. I think that's fun. I think that's a way to keep things uh, interesting. You were not supposed to do that when I was above you. You don't start that animation when I'm not in your crosshairs. Do I need to tell you how to play this game? Oh, close one. Biatch. Angel Room, please. Or Devil Room again, I guess. Uh, that's going to get rerolled most likely. I am going to take Death's Touch, even though I kind of don't want to. And then we're just going to get... I don't care about that, because we're going to reroll the range upgrade. Oh, that's nice. All right, that's a nice uh, thing. Yeah, I'm not that big a fan of Death's Touch, just because it's, it's too much of a centralizing item. Like, once you get Death's Touch... It's like, what else even matters? Like, do I even have to play the rest of this game? Like, we know what's going to happen. Look at all these keyholes. I'm going to do it because this has a key in it. Watch. Uh, yeah, yeah. I almost want to get the card, but not like this. Not like this. Yeah, activity on my channel's been slow. I understand. There's, I've just, I've sort of lost luster for games. Like, not specific, actually, specific games, yes. I've lost luster for the specific games that I am supposed to be playing. But it's just a matter of time before new games come out that fill up my time, and I don't know. My enthusiasm for gaming as a whole has been kind of on a steady downward decline. As opposed to those upward declines that uh, are so prevalent in today's economic station. Just two times? Come on. I don't know. I think, I think it started. I think my decline in an excite overall excitement started around 2008. Or seven. Whatever the year after World at War came out. Because World at War marked the last game I can truly remember being head over heels. Like, I had so much fun playing this game. Everything else beyond that has been fun. There's been really good games. But they just don't, like, elicit the same emotional attachment or response. And I don't know why that would be, but... Games are only getting better, and that's just objectively the truth. But, I don't know. I guess you just reach that point as you get older, where nostalgia starts to, like, grow and, like, fester. And then, and then you, you know, you uh, remember things much better than they actually were. Although I've played World at War since then. And even though it's, like, a completely modded invincibility mess now, like... When you do get a match that's regular and clean, you know, it's still it's just as solid as it was. Mm -hmm. 
I do want to do that. I want to do all of that. But wait till you get a flying card. No, fuck you. I want this now. The sun card is good. Red patch, I guess. Dog out so I can see the map. Yep, that's good. And the sun card so I can see even more of the map. Plus also if I want to kill some enemies. For example... Glad I got that room sorted. What do we got? Empress card and the moon card. Let's use the moon card right now. Key tower card. Why don't we use the tower card right now? That blew up some of the mushrooms, but not any of the ones that had anything in them. Why don't we just make a beeline for the item room? All right, we got a battery. We'll remember that's there. Free bomb. Free other bomb. Free golden chest. Well, not free. It still costs a key, but you know what I was going for there. Magic mushroom makes me larger. Having a... We'll have more trouble dodging things. But, you know, who's to say? Empress card, that's right. All right, let's go. Uh, yep. Yeah. This is this is a weird. There's spider webs here, sure, but like, why is why are there rocks? Like, oh, you're gonna make a choice to waste a bomb just so you don't take half a second longer to go through with spider webs. Whatever, man. I almost want to do that. Okay, well, he, let's see what's in it first. That's worth it. That is. All right, well, couldn't get it in one, but that's A-OK, -okay, because now the shop is worth a damn. Also, not going to go in there. Or, I mean, not going to. There we go. What is? What do you do again? Lazy Worm. Oh, yeah, really low shot speed. Piss off. Daddy Long Legs is good. It's really good. Okay. Oh, my nose. What's going on with it? I killed them all without even blowing up that TNT. That's some goddamn savantism right there, I gotta tell you. If I'm being completely honest with myself, that's like the best thing that ever happened. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's right. I thought I was walking into the secret room, even though the map would tell me that I was incorrect on that assumption. I guess I should have paid more attention. I'll take those five keys. <laughs> What's this shit? Judgment, nice. Nice judgment. Where should I put that? Probably in the devil room that I may or may not actually get. But still. Alright. Alright. Oh, look at this money. Oh, but I remembered. this. The shop is now not going to sell me items right now because there was greed in it, so pointless. And, oh, but give me judgment in here anyway. I mean, you're going to be... It's going to be a health upgrade, but then we're just going to re-roll it, you know? Because it's pretty much always been a health upgrade now. Like, is that a thing that it's all... Oh, no, luck upgrade. Nope, fuck that. Uh, blue map. Nope, fuck that. Uh, Bogo bombs. Nope, fuck that. Eventually... There's another battery somewhere. Actually, we have a few. We've got the time. Also, I'll take that Empress card and that battery. Thank you. we got the time to be discerning about what we want to get from here. That ain't it either, got to say. Are you? Is there? An? Great. Exactly what I was hoping for. Okay. Back to yet another battery. Fuck you. That, wow, wow, would you look at that? That's that's my angel room chance. Just completely gone. I hate spikes. 
That's why I think Callus is like one of the best trinkets in the game. Battery's up. There's a battery here. Why did I walk past it? Because it was never on my screen. I see. I understand now. Thank you for showing me. Is there anything down there? No? Okay. No kind of library or anything? That was a nice net crack. Compulsive. Has to happen sometimes. What am I doing? Where am I going? The shop items that way. But I actually am going to... Oh, this is Dank Tabs too, though. Can I get out anymore? I know you can get the Devil Room, but I don't remember if you can get out of the mom fight. Let me just... Just in case. Well, I mean, the mom fight's going to pay out with Polaroid, whatever, and you're just going to want to take that. All right, objective benefit, and that's all we're going to take from it. I downloaded that Four Kings Casino game on PS4, and that shit is... They really want you to buy chips with your real money. And I'm like, no. And they're like, but you can't really get them any other way. And I'm like, well, too bad. I guess I'm just going to log in every day for the next week and a half until I get enough to buy another game of poker. Of course, it's not my fault that I have no chips. When every time I spend a bunch to enter a high-stakes poker game, the game freezes and I immediately forfeit because of that. So, that's really not on me, game. You gotta not let the game freeze and ruin my bet and make me lose all my chips. Because otherwise, we don't want to come back. You know what I mean? Like, I've just been looking... I've been, I haven't been looking for a poker... I've been looking for a poker game, but not, like, a specifically a poker game. Like, I've been looking for a game that just has poker in it. That's why I was like, oh, Far Cry 4 has poker, right? No, it doesn't. Although, if it does, I haven't found it. But there was, like, a companion app with it or something that's like poker. But Far Cry 3 had poker. So I'm like, why wouldn't Far Cry 4 have poker? Anyway. And by poker, I mean specifically Texas Hold'em. That's, that's the only kind of poker that I think is worth a damn. Um, let's go Polaroid. As always. All right, we earned nothing there. But at least we're 30 minutes into the video, and we just got to the womb. That's about where I would want me to be. And by that, I mean, like, behind 15 minutes. Star's car. That's a, that's a nice little piece of shit there. I'll take that spirit heart. That spirit heart's real nice. I need to get to the boss room. Hold on. <coughs> Excuse me. I like it when they line up and I got piercing shots. Well, we're still alive. And by alive, I mean like we still like have all our red hearts. There is still a chance we gonna get that we going to get that devil room. Oh, I'm going to get that devil room. Ain't nothing going to stop me. Like, they're going to try, but then they're going to find out that, you know, they mess with the wrong bitch, you know what I'm saying? So, you wrong-ass bitch. You mess with the wrong ass. Ah! Oh! Well, I mean, this room was going to get me anyway. Look at that shit. There's no, how do you, how do you, how do you? I hate eyes. Like, they just, they always hit me. Like, even if I just, like, move back and forth like that, like, they still. Even though they didn't hit me there, like, they still hit me, though. You're like, yeah. I have to say the Empress card. For the uh, the 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 mom's hard fight, no, that's unacceptable. That's actually less acceptable. Come on, come on now. That's fine. I mean, that's the best of the three options. Let's go. My nose isn't even stuffed or runny. It just like it has. It needs to be sniffed. Like, it doesn't, there's no, there's no credible source for why that would be. 
but yet I'm compelled to do it anyway, so... I don't know. I'll take the Devil card. That's a, That might be better than the Empress, and by that I mean it's the exact same, almost. Oh, I did not want to step on that. Thank you for not being a thing that... Oh, what's that? Oh, I need what's in that door. If it's a run re-roller, I'm going to do it because I'm whimsical like that. And also because it would probably help. <laughs> but it's not. Just more keys and coins. It's all about that greed. Oh, this is I, I have to I have to take this opportunity to um, advertise one of the greatest things I ever saw in my whole life. You know how Netflix has like those pick those Disney shorts, Walt Disney shorts, animation shorts. Like it's a thing. It's like a collection of shorts. You know, it makes sense that that would be what it is because that's what it's called. Uh, there, watch that. What like a pretty much half of them are like world shaking in terms of how much they will make you cry and think about the world um watch feast watch uh, paperman and especially watch the little match girl because the little match girl will have you on a freaking tear bender for like the next 15 minutes And it's just right at the end. It's like it's like a three minute story, and just right at, well five, just right at the end. It will it will like pull your heart out your ass and then make you eat it through your eyeballs. Is uh, an accurate assumption, accurate description of what that does. So absolutely, and it's a re oh this is a reroll room four. Kind of a waste. Rerolls items. Not that they're even... Oh, maybe... Oh, that could be good. That rerolls the library again, I think. Book of Revelations, I'll take... Oh, I can't use it. Oh, did we use these already? I don't think we used them. They just didn't let me... I guess rerolling them didn't give them full charges. That doesn't really make sense, but... Whatever, this is happening. Oh, yeah, devil card, huh? Yeah. All right. Bye-bye. Mm, All right, cool. Up to the cathedral. This is the part where I start to lose steam if my run's not super powerful. I'm just like, why? I'm not, like, gaining any progress or anything, so... You know, it's just going through the motions to get to the end of the game at this point. You know, you know what I always say. If you're not overpowered, you're underpowered. That is a sunburned albino quote. Anybody else uses that shit, make sure that you know that it originated with me. Not like demanding credit. It's like, if I hear it, then I'll just be like, oh, there's another person who was influenced by the great sunburned albino. And we'll take pride in that. Uh, I don't know how much health I have. I'm going to go in here. What a waste of time. 
How much health do I have, huh? Do you think I have one heart left? Because I think I might possibly have counted correctly that I have one heart left. If I die, it's not a big deal. You know, you got the gist of this run by now. Give me that key. Alright, I can kill War without taking a hit. It'll be a cinch. <laughs> my eyes are glazed over and I'm fixated on the center of the screen. I ain't even watching what my character's doing. That's not the smartest way to play this game. But it is the way I'm playing this game. Okay, this pill can't be... Okay, well that's an extra heart, I guess. That means I have two hearts now. Oh, there's a regeneration, so I have two and a half. Well, there goes one. I knew it before it even happened. Oh, tears down. Oh, I... That's real nice. The game's always out to help me. And that's got to be, are you a wizard? Because that's what it says in the corner. Makes sense, huh? Oh my god, two mega fatties. I do not have time for this. I was not supposed to... Oh, yep, yep, we're at the end of our rope here. I'm going to blow that shit up. Oh, there were E. Okay. Well, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.